Hey there guys, my name is Tross Field. I'm a rig welder with Legion Pipe and Fabricators. Uh, we are on site at Legion's Pipe and Fabrication Shop in Nisky, Alberta. Today we'll be doing a couple mock-up welding demonstrations with Dakota Sterling and also Daryl Basaraba. I'll be passing you to uh, Jameson with the Cutting Edge Industrial. Hey, Jameson here with Cutting Edge Industrial. I'm the creator of the Step Wedge. You may know these in the States as the B&B &B Wedge. Um, today we're going to be talking step wedges and spatter proof wedges. So this is a new wedge I'm introducing to the market. Um, the idea here is spatter resistant, the first wedge of its kind that is actually spatter resistant. Um, if you haven't seen the step wedges before, you'll notice we have a, a 1 16, 3 32, 1 8, 5 32, 3 16 and quarter inch gaps, all within 5 thou tolerance. So these are machined to be very precise. Um, we have a 4 inch model, a 6, a fat 6, and a fat eight. So whether you're doing big bore or small bore, we got all your bases covered. Uh, Travis, you've had some experience with these wedges. What do you think? Oh yes, well, I got the Legion display cabinet here. I uh, actually did about 90% of these welds here. There's also some aluminum ones over there also. But uh, see, the purpose of this display cabinet was for uh, clients. When clients come in, they see the quality and the workmanship that is at Legion Pipe and Fabricators. I use the step wedges to make sure my gap was nice, everything was uniform correct amperage the whole way through the entirety of the weld. Well, and the nice thing about using these is your, your client knows you're following the weld procedure. You're getting the exact root, the exact gap you need to be on point. So that being said, let's go to the shop and put these to the test. Hey, we're back in the shop here at Legion Piping Fabricators. Uh, we have our step wedge and our spatter proof wedge. Daryl's gonna be welding out a uh, six inch 6010 root. Uh, we're gonna be rolling that out. So Daryl, what's the plan? Uh, plan is I'm going to take the fit this up for a 6010 roll like Jameson said I'm going to use the step wedge and the spatter proof wedge. I usually like to set my gap between 1 16th and 3 32 for a 6010 roll with the 1 8 rod. So I'm going to put the wedge in there get my gap nice. Oh, for tacking I'm going to pass that off to you. I'm going to use the the brand new spatter proof. Let's throw a tack on here. Okay bright light. Okay, so we have our uh, spatter proof wedge here. We're gonna show you how spatter proof this thing really is. We're gonna put this inside, slide it in. Daryl's gonna put a root pass in and get it nice and dirty, and then we'll scrape it off. Here we go. Okay, straight right. Beauty. There we have it. Okay, so now we're gonna fit up some 24 inch. We have our spatter proof wedge and our step wedge. Uh, what wall thickness is this? Uh, 375 wall. 375 wall. So what we'll be doing for this particular pipe, a 24 inch 375 wall, is uh, while we're fitting, we'll be using the step wedge. As we progress with the root pass, we'll be using the spatter proof wedge. Uh, the spatter proof wedge will be using to keep the gap uniform without shrinking up on us as we commence the root pass. As I start welding, pull, pull out the wedge. Keep going, pull out the other wedge. That's what we'll be doing on this mock-up here. Beautiful. Gab's a little bit tight here. Put the wedge in there. Should be using a hammer, but uh, I have a good gap now. I'll start welding from here, weld down to the six o'clock there. Travis, it was a pleasure. Thank you for having us at Thank Legion Piping much. Fabricators. Thank you very much. Um, so when it comes to the spatter proof wedges and the step wedges, fitting a big bore, small bore, where are the advantages for you? Actually, I found them quite uh, handy because uh, for fitting, I could, uh, rather than eyeball it, I could just say, okay, this is a perfect 332, 116, 18, you know? And uh, especially for the other wedges, as it progressed down the pipe, it was slamming up tight a little bit as it progressed with the weld. 
The other wedges, the spatter proof wedges, were handy for uh, you know keeping the gap uniform. And uh, I don't have any spatters stuck to them when I need them, you know, laid down in the pipe. So they're fantastic. In your opinion, is there another wedge in the market that repels spatter like this? No, no. These are pretty, Beautiful. pretty, uh, pretty stout. Pretty That's nice. what I wanted to hear. Thank you. Now this video will be put on the WeldTube uh, YouTube channel. You can find them on Instagram and YouTube. Myself, Travis Field, uh, Dakota Sterling, uh, Daryl Bafaraba. Jamison Burt. Thanks guys, take care.